Welcome back to Fan Nation, presented by J.P. Roofing. Now, Turner's Tea is a staple in the city of Pittsburgh. And being from Penn Hills, I need some right now. What are you Hold doing on. to this? Let me do something. You for are you. ruining this for me, Daisy. Yep. I was going to drink that. I'm doing you a favor. Go ahead and try it. What do you think? What do you think? Mm. Come on. Mm, this is amazing. Unbelievable. Right? I love it. It's like a concoction crafted by the Yinzer heavens above. I need more of this right now. I knew you'd like it, but I can't take credit for it, but I can show you a place where you can find some more. There was a lot of anticipation for this over the years. So you have two extremely iconic Pittsburgh companies, two extremely Yinzer type or um, supported by uh, Pittsburgh companies. Keep in mind, you just don't take beer and Turner's or anything and just blend it together and put it in uh, a can. Uh, there's a lot of chemistry and a lot of adjustments that needed to be made. So it took a while to dial it in. I do believe that the product and liquid we have now is very good, very tasty, and I think a lot of people are really, really going to enjoy it. The can uh, obviously screams Turner's and it screams Pittsburgh Brewing. There isn't one person who's not going to know exactly what they're getting into. This screams Pittsburgh. I can't think of anything else more iconic or more um, exciting to, uh, to try. So naturally, we had to put it to a taste test. So what better way than to visit Mike's Beer Bar with Pittsburgh's biggest fans? Hey, guys. What's up, girls? to be so refreshing on a hot day. It truly is a bird thing. I know Turner C has a thing on some Yinzer fuel, but this is called Yinzer juice. New York City might have their Long Island iced tea. Here in Pittsburgh, we have Neville Island iced tea. Yeah. Yeah. Nothing cool steel bands furnace quite like an Iron City beer. Here we go, Steelers. Here we go. I feel like this is the Kenny Pickett of beers. It's the total package. It's got everything you want. There's the beer taste. There's the lemon iced tea finish. It's everything. There's not one aspect of this beer that I don't think is outstanding. All right, Daisy, so that is a wrap for this one. That's right. Well, we're going to go enjoy some drinks, but until then, we'll see you next week right here on Fan Nation, presented by J.P. Roofing on KDK TV. I'm Daisy J. And I'm Rich Walsh. Have a great weekend. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.